While all this drama has been going on in British politics, over in France, Emmanuel Macron's government has just nationalised EDF. They did it whilst being in the EU too. What a Marxist commie bastard, eh? The fact is the French government already owned 84% of the company, but has decided it wants to own 100% of it, so it has full control over a company which basically sits at the heart of the nation's nuclear strategy. It has chosen to do this so it can deal with their energy price and production issues and take back control. Of course, part of EDS nuclear strategy happens to be the new nuclear power station being built at Hinkley Point. So where France wants to take back control of its own means of energy production, we are happy to hand our means of energy production to the French too. I wonder who will get stung more, the British or the French customers? Oh wait, this will be why French electricity bills have only risen by 4% in the face of this energy crisis we're all living through. Because the French government was a major stakeholder in EDF, whereas here, our energy bills went up by 54% because we don't have any control over our energy infrastructure. It all got privatised and sold off. If you're with EDF, the French government is now dictating what you'll be paying, and that is certainly more than they are in France. British gas is owned by Centrica, who are German, as is E.ON. Scottish power is Spanish-owned, and SSE shifted its UK assets to a Swiss holding company to dodge renationalisation under a potential Corbyn-led government. Yet centrist Macron has done just that. Privatisation has been ripping us off for decades in all manner of ways because we no longer own so much of the infrastructure of our services that we all rely on. We are paying far higher bills across the board in all kinds of services right now than other countries do because of it. We're subsidising their native customers. We're being exploited and it won't end until we demand different. We should have control of our own services. Wasn't this why so many of you voted to leave the EU? To take back control? How about demanding government starts actually doing it then? It's not communist or Marxist. It's just common bloody sense.